feeling like Ricky. About to go crazy. Watch she go retarded. <laughs> They ask for it, I deliver it. That's just that's just how I move. You know what I mean? You ask for it. and also a professional uh, soccer field, tennis court, and also a stable for horses. So the main house is that house over there. I want to show you the main house and what happened over there. So remember, La Manuela. That was a nightclub. Huh? That was a nightclub, yeah. The private nightclub over there, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that property was confiscated now by the, by the government. How many years ago? In 1993. When, after, when Pablo Escobar get killed, the, the government just confiscated the property. So let me show you the, the main house over there. property in 1993, eight months before Pablo Escobar get killed, 
that property was bombed by the cartel of Medellin, eh, cartel of Cali, and Los Pepes, you know Los Pepes was a big organization against Pablo Escobar, Colombian government, paramilitary forces, CAA, DAA, and also the cartel of Cali, they worked together to try to kill Pablo Escobar, because when Pablo Escobar, in 1992, Pablo Escobar escaped from the cathedral prison, so at that moment that was too dangerous, so everybody tried to catch Pablo Escobar, and that was a reward, $10 million for Pablo Escobar here, back then. Uh -huh, yeah, that's a lot of money. Yeah. Today is a lot of money, as well as you yeah. can imagine. <laughs> so, you can imagine how much money this guy has. So, Gonzalo Rodriguez Gacha, nicknamed the Mexican. Okay, I'll get it. Just buy the property and put there La Fortaleza de Chalo, just like a lap in the government, like a Chalo's Fortress. So, this guy in 1988 appeared in Forbes Magazine like a world's billionaire. Yes. Next year appeared Pablo Escobar. He just saw next to the city they called the Mexican, eh, the El Mariachi. El, 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 el Mexicano. El, 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 el Mexicano El Mariachi. El Mariachi, that was his nickname. Over there in Cundinamarca, when he's from Cundinamarca, is you know, the, the state close to the Bogota. So, over there, the government confiscated him around 4,000 properties. Wow. So, you can imagine.
transport, I deliver it. I'm that kind of guy. You know what I mean? I'm that kind of guy. It's like another, another showcase up there. Just, you know? I ain't gonna cap. Even down there, we catch everything. But, it's like more tools going in there and everything, so. But like I said, y'all ask for it, I deliver. And I'm sure it's gonna be amazing. Oh, there's lunch. 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 Oh, there's lunch.